Well, tonight, nearly 40% of Americans are fully vaccinated against COVID-19. But we're learning more tonight about how long that protection may last and when you'll need a booster shot. CBS's Nikki Batiste has all the details. Tonight, a COVID vaccine booster could be necessary by fall for people who are already fully vaccinated. Uh, I believe in one, two months we will have enough data to speak about it with much uh, higher scientific certainty. Dr. Anthony Fauci says the vaccines are effective for at least six months, likely more, but boosters will probably be needed. It's really going to depend on following what the durability of immunity is and essentially recommending it at an appropriate time. The first dose of Pfizer's vaccine in the U.S. was administered five months ago to a critical care nurse from New York. This comes as states scramble to get the first dose into arms. We have the Moderna vaccine. In Philadelphia, where demand has slowed, the city is going to the community. I feel safe now. Today, there was a twofer on offer, a shot and a free meal. We're just not going to get back to normal unless we take care of uh, the folks who, you know, um, may be homeless or struggling um, with poverty. How are you today? In Rhode Island, nurse Angela Flynn went door to door to vaccinate the homebound. As soon as they see you with that cooler, their face lights up. She gave shots to Patrick Gallagher and his bedridden wife, Karen. It would be very difficult to get her vaccinated if it weren't for this program. Gambling on getting more shots into arms in Maryland. The state launched a lottery for vaccinated residents today with a $40,000 prize. Uh, we'll continue to do this every day for 40 straight days. Here in Philadelphia, there is still an indoor mask mandate until at least June 11th. One reason is that more than half of the city's population is still unvaccinated, including about half of firefighters and police workers. Nora. All right, Nikki Batiste, thank you.